it's been a long time since I first wrote the play. Um, but what I remember is that I had an image in my mind of the way the show opens with a young man on stage talking to the audience and his mother's in the audience. And I think at the time I was working on my own relationship with my parents and this notion of like Tom Wingfield in The Last Menagerie on stage and his mother interrupting, I just thought it was funny. Um, so I didn't really have a story, but it was also around the time I was living in New York, I was alone, and I think I was doing my own exploration about Judaism, and that was really what the play became about. And the fact that the neo-Nazi Skokie incident became a part of the play was not the impetus, but it had happened a few years before, uh, and it became kind of a way to add some dramatic structure and some specificity to time and place to the piece that I just thought was interesting. Uh, so it was really my work on the play and my exploration of that incident and my own exploration of Judaism at the time that became the play.